Hey, Uberville Lift Van Drivers, how's everybody doing today? Fantastic! Well, today is your lucky day because today is, that's right, it's Tip Jar Tuesday! <laughs> yes, indeed, ladies and gentlemen, another week has come and gone in the life of Uber DC. And uh, we had some good tips, good tips. Uh, it started off very slow the week. Actually, if you saw my vlog, you saw like my first 15 or so rides. I wasn't getting squat. Um, a lot of short trips, uh, no money to be made. But um, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday turned everything around. And uh, we're going to count the money here shortly. But first... I need to get to Starbucks. We'll be right back, everybody. Thanks for watching another episode of Tip Jar Tuesday with yours truly, Uber DC. It's Thanksgiving week. So I don't know what the business is going to be like this week, but we'll be right back and count the money. Stay tuned, everybody. Alrighty, well, welcome back. Yes, we've uh, got our Starbucks and our holiday cup. <laughs> Glad they uh, went back to those. Today we're uh, doing a peppermint mocha, but the guy got carried away with the uh, peppermint pumps, I think. That's a little too sweet, but it's hot and it's good. That's all that matters. All right, so let's get to counting the money, shall we? As we look back at our uh, Uber report, um, electronic tips, like I said, uh, the week started off really bad, but it uh, ended up pretty strong. Um, I got uh, $30 in electronic tips, which it could have been, uh, it wasn't looking good to begin with, so I'm happy with that. And one of those tips was a uh, $10 uh, electronic tip, and uh, a short story on that, um, I went to uh, do a pickup that was at a uh, country club, and they happened to be having a bar mitzvah, and the guy was putting in his grandfather possibly even his great-grandfather um, they had a wheelchair uh, they weren't going too far it was about a half hour trip and uh, when I got there before I uh, uh, turned off the uh, app that the trip was completed I called the uh, customer the son who put his uh, either his father or his grandfather back into the car and uh, let him know that I got him to uh, him and his caretaker back to their uh, retirement home in one piece and safely in the whole bit and the guy was really appreciative of that and uh, he gave me a ten dollar uh, tip on the electronic app so I don't know if that had anything to do with it or not but uh, he was very appreciative that I uh, called and let him know that everybody got back in one piece so something to think about if you're uh, helping out uh, anybody who needs uh, additional assistance uh, go the extra step you never know you never know all right so thirty dollars in uh, electronic tips ten of that was one single tip uh, cash tips, let's count it, shall we? Um, got a nice stack here. I don't know how much yet, because like I like to do, I like to be surprised the same time <laughs> you guys are, if you're surprised at all, I don't know. All right, so let's go with the lickety-lickety in the three, two, one. Lickety, lickety, a little triple there. All right, ten. 15, 20, 25, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41. All right, not bad. Can't complain. 41 to 30, 71 dollars. Pretty good, pretty good considering I only did, I did 30 trips last week. I uh, didn't drive at all on Thursday because of the weather. And uh, but my weekend, Friday, Saturday, Sunday was pretty good. It was pretty good money wise. Uh, definitely made up on the trips. Like I said, I was less than a hundred after three days, and I made uh, another two hundred. Uh, excuse me, two hundred and thirty dollars more um, after the, on the weekend. Um, and I didn't really drive a whole lot. Is I should have driven a lot more. And there's definitely. Uh, I could have driven a lot more, but I did have some good long trips, so that, that helped out. 
Um, so that's it. That is uh, the week that was. Uh, we'll take that uh, $71 in uh, tips. That will come in handy. And um, let's see. I don't know what this week's going to bring. Thursday being Thanksgiving. Oh, I got to think Friday's going to be pretty busy. It's going to be Black Friday. Um, all over the place. I, I'm, I'm imagining a lot of uh, trips all over the place, which is good. And uh, one thing I want to remind you guys, and uh, a, a passenger told me this this weekend, uh, the, an incident they had with uh, Uber Pool, and I know you guys all run into this. Um, you can't take Uber Pool with three people or more, and I'm sure the drivers are all aware of this. Passengers are not, and uh, this one gal was in a ride, and she said the guy, driver went to pick up somebody. They tried to squeeze three people in the car and on an Uber Pool fare. And the, the driver's balls must have shrank up because he allowed it anyway. And the woman, was she was telling me that, you know, she wasn't comfortable with it. She moved to the front seat, had those three guys sit in the back, which is probably what she should do. But um, not knowing the situation, you got to just, you know, remind the guy, hey, you can't do it. You know, Uber pool is for two or less. I actually shouldn't have taken a second passenger. That's what I do. I don't pick up the second pool. So, anyhow, enough on that. Uh, also, look for another video. I'm going to do a video this week on why you guys should have a tip jar in your car. Um, I had another uh, customer talk about it, or we just, we talked about it when he was, saw my tip jar. And uh, I'm going to do a video on that. So, that, look for that in the next uh, day or two. Because uh, I'm probably going to do it right after this video. All right, everybody. Um, as always... Super on, lift on, be safe. Fresh bottle of water, stay hydrated. It's chill too, it's gonna taste good. And with that, I am out of here. Good night, everybody. Happy Thanksgiving to all who celebrate. Yes, yes, yes. I do have a song chosen especially for all of you. <laughs> Peace.